any girl you don't want I adore Your love bring me serenity Every night I pray before I sleep Because I found you love you No, no, pal, I do this for real Can't tell you the ways you made me feel I wanna love you for life, my future, my wife You leave and I'ma miss you My loving ain't an issue, you rockin' with me Miss Mafia, how are you guys feeling today? I hope blessed, of course. As for me, I am feeling blessed. I feel good. My energy is a little bit off, That's as you guys time. can tell by the title. Today is June 24th. Today marks two years since my uncle was taken from us. It is a sad day, but one thing is for sure is that he wouldn't want to see us sad. He definitely would want to see us smiling. And he hated when you cried and stuff like that, so. It's just hard, you know. Right now, we're about to link up with the family. We're gonna go by the tree. And for those of you that don't know, why do we go to the tree? We we go to the tree to light up candles. Mm -hmm. And then, um, I'm sorry, baby. Say hi to Mitch Mafia. Hi. What else are we gonna do? Hang out with the family? Yeah, we're gonna hang out with the family for a little while. Um, light the candles, let the balloons go. That's and my no social distancing. Yeah, <laughs> it's hard to social distance. So 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 you hear me? social distance around the family. But right now we're about to go pick up some candles. But if you guys are wondering why do we go to the tree? Is because that's where he was murdered. It was right by the tree, and that's where his body was found. Um, I know that's like very detailed, but that's the truth. So that's why we go to the tree and that's the specific tree that we go to where we light the candles and we let the balloons go and all of that stuff. So I was about to cry, know it. <laughs> um, no. I, I've cried a lot. I cried she all cried night last all night all and this morning and yeah, I've cr I've cried a lot. So and I'm uh, it's it hits me, you know, it's a it's a it's a roller coaster, yeah, you know, and this is something she, she cried all That's crazy. Night. I was thinking we going to your mother house. You mean see what I was about to do? Yes, our <laughs> Let me see your shirt. Like, no, Who's that? My dad. Like, That's your daddy. daddy.
is how we do it. It's our family. Alright guys, so it is the very next day. I actually just put on this hat and the shirt that I had on yesterday. So I did this purposely just so I can end the video. So yesterday I really didn't do too much talking. I basically was just filming what was going on. That's usually how we do it. During the first year when he first passed away, every 24th, we actually got together, went to the tree and let balloons go. And then now every year, moving forward, God willing, we will always get together and make candles for him and let go of the balloons and stuff like that. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I'm gonna be mad if you guys can't hear me because that AC is loud but it's hot. It's probably not gonna be a long video. I don't know how long it's going to be, honestly. But I definitely want to post it because this means everything to me. He meant everything to me. This is something that I want to look back at and I'm sure my family wants to look back at always. And whenever they're thinking about what did we do for the first year, what did we do for the second year or whatever, I want them to be able to come to our channel and see and remember and feel. And that's one thing I love about having a YouTube channel, guys, the fact that we can look back at our videos, that the memories, oh my goodness, memories are everything. Memories are so important. In. They're so important. Just videos, pictures, that's so, so, so important because God forbid you lose somebody that you love and just imagine not having no pictures of them, no videos of them. Just imagine. Like, oh my goodness. I'm so thankful that Matt actually likes to take pictures. He loves to be in pictures. We have so much pictures of him with him. I'm so grateful and thankful for that. That I can just go into my phone and look at pictures of him. There is actually people out there that do not like to take pictures at all. They will not get in your pictures. They will move. They will hide. They will. You know what I'm saying? If you know somebody like that, if you have, even if you have to sneak pictures, sneak those pictures, save them to your phone, and don't ever delete them. <laughs> like just save all your memories. I've done loss. So many pictures because I didn't have an external drive or I lost my phone or whatever the case you know and oh my goodness I think about that and I'm like I get sad about it but it's just like moving forward I know what to do now I will never make that same mistake again you know so having memories having those pictures and those videos man listen cherish those I love the fact that I can put this video up and tomorrow or next month or next year i want to come back and i want to watch this video i can you know i can relive it all over again and just just by watching the video and that's just so important i really didn't have anything to say yesterday to be honest it's june 24th is a very hard 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 day to deal with you know and then being around my family and being around the people that he loves and just that is a feeling that I cannot explain and I still can't believe it. I still can't believe that he's gone. I told myself I wasn't gonna cry, but grief is something that we're gonna live with forever. That saying that time heals all wounds, it's not true. Love is forever. So how can grief not be forever? You know what I mean? This has scarred me for life. I know. 10 years, 30 years from now, I'm still gonna cry like a baby. Thinking, what if, you know? Cause I really, <laughs> you know, as a kid, you really think about forever, you know? You think everything just lasts forever. You don't, you don't think about people dying. As you get older, all the things that you took for granted and the time you took for granted and thinking that you have time when only God knows. Some days are better than others. Some days I'm smiling at the memories. And then there's the other days where I think about the memories and I just lose it. I completely lose my mind. But yeah, I just wanted to tell you guys how I've been feeling and stuff like that. Because it, it is two years later. 
I'm gonna end the video right here guys we love you guys so much thank you so much for being on this journey thank you all for the support don't forget to like comment share and subscribe guys if you're new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe I also wanted to show you guys my shirt this is a really old picture <laughs> here you got Matt's twin that's Nay that's me then you got Matt right here with his pacifier. Always had his pacifier in his mouth. Nay too, but Nay didn't have it here. They always had pacifiers. They had pacifiers so they were like 10. <laughs> and then there's my brother. I love this picture so much. But all right guys, we'll see you in the next video. Oh, oh.